Welcome back. We're speaking with Malcolm and Deborah Sussmore. Uh, Deborah is living with type 1 diabetes, but she sure hasn't lost the zest for life. She was just recently telling us about her marathon. We started the marathon that day with 40,000 people, and can you imagine the noise of 40,000 people hitting the pavement? <laughs> it was pretty amazing. It was, it was just a, an incredible feeling to be there, and I was so respectful of the people that were running it and the training that they put into it and, and what they would experience. We started, before you knew it, we were at the five kilometer mark. I was kind of getting, kind of, um, enjoying the experience at this point. There are 40,000 people doing the marathon. Lining the streets are a million spectators. Along the, every uh, mile or two, there's bands playing, wonderful music. The support is incredible. Uh, we were dancing through the, uh, by the bands. We were, um, we were just laughing and grinning and wishing people to have a great race. The next thing you knew, we were at the 21 kilometer mark. This is way beyond what I thought. I didn't think I could walk one. We get to 10K. We get to 21 kilometers. Time for a, a porta potty stop. Now, the reason I'm telling you that is it's a very significant part of my story. My mother, at the age of 65 years old, was running the marathon. Um, as I'm about to enter a porta potty, somebody was coming out, and that somebody was my mother. She was coming out of the porta potty as I was coming in and uh, with big hugs, tears of joy. She couldn't believe I, was, I had made it this far because she knew I'd been so injured. Um, we all completed the marathon, 42.2 kilometers of that marathon that day in New York City. And it was so significant in my life, that marathon experience for me, because I really adjusted my whole mindset. I developed more of a a positive attitude about the journey, enjoying the journey rather than just get to the goal, just get to the goal and that's all, because that's all I'd been focused on. And it, it really adjusted my whole attitude in life about just relaxing and accepting and enjoying and don't live for one moment way off in the future and enjoy it. And it was a great day overall. We had a, a blast. I had the most, the best guides. My mother was there, my husband ran it. And um, I mean, it, it couldn't have been better really. It was very different than it turned out. I mean, I'd had my time down. I knew what I was gonna do and I was gonna do this great <laughs> marathon and break all records and all this stuff. But no, 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 not that day. But you know, it's, it's funny how things work out. Oh, it was a good fabulous. learning experience for me.